capture and direct handling can be very stressful for marmosets. They may associate certain cues with being captured or handled, such as the appearance of gloved hands. The anticipation of handling can in itself be upsetting. Marmosets should only be captured if there is no alternative and if it is absolutely necessary, for example, for veterinary work. For tasks such as collar cleaning and weighing, an alternative is to train marmosets to cooperate. This can be done using a technique called positive reinforcement training. Marmosets are given rewards for performance of a particular desired behaviour, positive reinforcement. Consistently pairing the performance of the behaviour with a small food reward means that the behaviour is more likely to be performed again. In order to weigh a pair of marmosets in their home cage, you need to be able to separate them. To achieve this, marmosets can be trained to hold particular targets. For example, a plastic spoon or fork. The marmosets are keen to cooperate because they anticipate a pleasurable food reward. These two marmosets have been trained to hold different coloured targets, in this case a black or white plastic fork. Look at the counter at the bottom of the screen and you will see the weight go up and down while they hold their targets. They have learned that holding their target for a few seconds will earn them a small food reward. The clicker sound lets the marmosets know that they have earned their reward. The bamboo skewer allows the reward to be directed to each marmoset in turn. The weight measurement stabilises while they are eating their reward. Keeping records of the weights of marmosets is important and constant body weights for adults are one sign of good welfare. This pair of marmosets does not associate the weighing scales with any stress and is able to relax on them. In fact, the weighing platform makes for a convenient perch on which to stretch out and groom each other. In marmosets, this behaviour indicates well-being. Positive reinforcement training can be very effective for other tasks such as moving marmosets, delivering medicine, collar cleaning or palpating to see if they are pregnant. However, it is very important that you learn the right techniques. Going on a course is a good way to learn positive reinforcement training.